What's up everybody and welcome back to the channel. Modern Warfare 3 has finally hit us and with that comes a slew of new weapons that we all have to level and if you're like me you want to do this as efficiently as possible and possibly knock out some camos and stuff like that while you're doing it. So luckily with the zombies mode that came out alongside the rest of the stuff that we got with Modern Warfare 3, there is a relatively, I would say, easy way to level weapons, albeit it might be a little bit boring depending on how you feel about this sort of thing. But essentially, let's have a look at that and let me explain the steps as to how you do this and you can start leveling those weapons. Legacy split. First and foremost, make sure to pick the weapon that you want to level in your insured slot. That guarantees that you have the gun available right from the beginning and you can start leveling. Of course, you can go moving around the map and kill stuff and hope to find a weapon that you want to level in one of the boxes or you can buy something off a wall or you can go to the mystery box. But it's definitely the easiest way to actually just take it in as an insured slot and, uh, you know, basically level from there. Now, bear in mind that just like DMZ from back in the day, if you die, your insured slot goes onto a cooldown. In this case with zombies, it's an hour. So if you do happen to unfortunately perish, you will have an hour cooldown time that you have to wait for the weapon to essentially uh, get ready so that you can level it again. But along the way, you'll also most likely pick up some other weapons, again, off of walls or enemies that you kill, which will go into your contraband slots. And you can, in the off times that your, con that your insured weapon is recharging, you can basically level those, or you can go play another mode like multiplayer or something like that. For the sake of this particular recording, I did not use any XP boost, uh, you know, weapon XP boost or anything like that, but you should absolutely use these if you have them available. I basically just wanted to test how efficient this method is, uh, even if you don't have weapon XP boost available. So launch into zombies and you'll notice right at the beginning you have 45 minutes of essential map time now that's not entirely true but there's because there's another 15 minutes of overtime that's hidden behind the 45 so you have a almost an hour's worth of killing that you can do so as soon as you start out with 45 minutes on the clock you have about two minutes until the extraction sites become available on the map. So in these two minutes, you know, find yourself uh, some plates, uh, maybe some, uh, you know, kill a couple of zombies, you know, level the gun up once or twice. If you can find some armor or something like that, definitely find yourself a vehicle because as soon as you get to 43 minutes left, make your way over to the nearest extraction. Now, it's super important that you pick an extraction in one of the outlying zones. You don't want to go in the yellow and you don't want to go in the red because those extraction zones will of course spawn zombies that are tougher and there really is no benefit to killing tougher enemies a let's call it tier 3 zombie gives exactly the same amount of xp as a tier 1 zombie and so therefore you should absolutely just kill the weak dude so find one of these extraction sites and then basically all you're doing is you're going up to the extraction site and you're pulling in the chopper you're killing every all every zombie that spawns and you're not getting on the chopper and leaving now along the way uh you're gonna get tons of ammo you're gonna get tons of plates you're gonna get tons of grenades and and a whole bunch of stuff so it is entirely possible to sustain yourself here you don't ever have to leave from the spot and you can literally do this for the entire duration of the 45 minutes feel free to use all this stuff that drops out of the zombies except the nukes because you don't get any xp for that and essentially just murder as much of these zombies as you can as the map time progresses more and more zombies will spawn so at the very beginning it's going to be a little super easy to maintain but eventually you'll have to train large amounts of zombies so get used to the area that you're playing in and essentially figure out the best way that you can essentially train the zombies into a giant snake and basically just kill them off starting with a weapon exactly from level one in about 45 minutes of grinding, I was able to get 12 levels out of that weapon, and that was without double XP. So that means that we could get about 24 levels, maybe 25 if you kill more efficiently than I do, out of one rotation, and that's pretty good. That's a, about enough to almost fully level every single one of the new weapons. Some of them go a little bit higher, and some of them go up to 22, 24, and so on. So that's more than enough XP to get you almost all the way on one weapon per deployment as long as you use double XP. As soon as you get close to the 45 minutes, start thinking about extracting. You can, of course, extract from exactly the same place that you've been at right now. It is important to extract, however, don't just quit out because you're going to get a huge amount of just normal account XP as well. 
you're going to do about four to five levels every time that you do this so this is a fantastic way for you to also just level through the standard levels that are in the game and you'll be hitting that close to 50 cap in you know almost no time and that's it for the video thank you so much for watching especially if you made it this far uh stick with the channel there's going to be a ton of zombies content coming i'm grinding out all of the missions and all of the other you know different things like secrets and all of that in the game and i'll be making a ton of videos starting today this is the first one of a whole series that i'm doing on zombies so if you enjoy the mode sit tight because there's a whole bunch more content coming let me know in the comments down below specifically what you're looking for if there's something about the mode that is not clear to you or anything that you need help with uh, i'm here to help and uh, i'll definitely prioritize and bump some of that to the top as i produce content uh, for this mode uh, other than that it's just super important to me that you have a fantastic morning afternoon evening wherever you are in the world till next video fucking cheers